How's it going everybody? Welcome back. So quickly going over how easy it is to install and use NordVPN. Okay, so if you want to install NordVPN, just click the link in the description down below. You'll be able to get a bit of a discount on your subscription to help you save a little more cash. And once you've subscribed, you'll get an email and you'll be able to download the VPN from there. Or you can simply go to the website itself. Again, you can click the link in the description down below just to make sure that the discount is applied in case you uh, go for the subscription uh, and then you can just download the VPN and then you can get your subscription after you've downloaded the VPN so once you click the download app just select your device right here and once you pick your device you'll be able to install it and just follow the instructions and click OK on everything and then you can use your credentials and log in to your VPN and this is what it's going to look like if you're on PC and it's going to look very similar whether you're on Mac Android, iOS, it's all going to have a very similar look with this uh, very intuitive map design. Okay, so let's see here. You've just logged into your VPN and you don't know what to do. Well, it's very easy. As you can tell, there's a map design. You can just zoom in right here and pick one of the countries. And once you click on one of the countries, you'll just simply connect to it. And it's as simple as that. You want to double check that you're connected to the right country. You can just go to what is my IP address address.com and you'll be able to see which IP address that you're connected to just to make sure and as you can tell yes it is Switzerland since I'm connected to Switzerland right here now there are a few other features that you might want to take note of you've got specialty servers right here which can be useful in all sorts of ways you've got threat protection and this is definitely important to turn on once you get your VPN uh, this will just protect your device overall it's a little bit of a mini antivirus you've got mesh net for remote access you're probably not going to need this right away dark web monitor if you'd like to activate that so that it can keep an eye out for leaked data linked to your email address passwords contacts or any other personal information and if you go to these settings right here you've got a uh, connection just make sure you're connected to nord links this will be the fastest protocol you've got custom dns for an easy way to change your dns the kill switch which will kill your internet connection if the vpn disconnects unexpectedly making sure that you're only going to be connected to the internet while you're secured by the vpn and split tiling will allow to choose which applications are routed through the VPN and which are not. This is a very useful feature as well. Now, NordVPN has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries, and you'll be able to secure up to six devices per subscription. You'll be able to watch your favorite shows using NordVPN by just connecting to the right country. And you'll also be able to secure your device while you're on public Wi-Fi, or if you just want to bypass some geo restrictions in order to access some websites that may not be available in your current location so it's as simple as that with regards to NordVPN again you can just click one of the dots in order to connect to a country or just go through the uh, servers right here maybe you want to connect to the states let's see here we've got a bunch of locations we'll just go with Chicago for example the moment I click it I'll be connected to the Chicago server and if I check on my what is my IP address right here the IP finder it'll say that I am now in Chicago and it's as simple as that with regards to using NordVPN and installing it again if you guys are interested you'll find the link in the description down below if you'd like to save a little bit more money and you'll find a full review if you'd like to learn a little bit more about NordVPN besides that comment below if you have any questions I'll be happy to Answer all of them, like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.